Hi, yes, I'm blonde. It's freaky. Every time I look in the mirror, freak myself out. But it is just stage one. The next stage is stage blue, which is funny because it rhymes with two. I bleached my hair yesterday because I want to go all blue, which I've wanted to do for ages, and I just decided I'd do it. These are the like blue bits that used to be blue. They're really gross. I kind of bleached it like far away from the roots, which looks awful now, but I'm hoping that it'll make it look more natural when it's blue and less high maintenance so I don't have to keep redoing it. So yeah, I just thought I'd film the process because I always like watching these kind of videos on YouTube. I'm going to be really happy to get rid of this yellowness. So, okay, I don't know how to start. I guess I'll do the bottoms first. Oh, I should take out my earrings. <laughs> so excited, I've been wanting to do this for a very long time. I do have brushes and stuff, but I always end up using my hands, so I'm just gonna go straight to using my hands. Goodbye, blonde Raya, you were interesting. Oh, I'm gonna have a really blue scalp. Maybe I'll put some purple in my fringe. Why not? I definitely don't want to miss any blonde bits. They need to be eradicated. This came from just like a mix of self-doubt, not liking my new haircut, being bored, not really having much self-control, so a really good mix. Already got so much on my ear. Oh, and my cheek. I can't tell if I'm reaching. How do people do the backs of their head? How do they know if they've got them all in? Uh, it's all over my neck. I feel like the bits I can see are going to be the most thorough, and then the rest is just going to look like shit. That's okay, because I won't be able to see it. <laughs> it's very flattering. I feel a lot more like myself now that I've got dark hair. also have very dark ears. Is there any more? Please. Yeah, that's a really good look. It's my signature look. Uh-oh. I have called for reinforcements. My hue. <laughs> God, how does it get everywhere? Oh dear. You have a messy job. Yes. I think I'm going to have to do this all the time. I can see you in the mirror. Thank you for your help. Oh my god. Okay, I'm all blued up finally. I'm going to wait for a bit and then wash it out and then I guess I'll show how it looks at the end because that's the fun bit. Okay. Well, I'm back. Yeah, there's lots of different shades. You can't really see it very well on the camera, but there's some purple and turquoise and I'm not really sure what it looks like at the back. Yeah, I'm actually really happy with it. It's kind of not super, super bright, which I like. Pretty subtle. Um, as subtle as blue hair can be. I like the roots. I like that it's dark at the roots and then goes gradually in and doesn't look too weird with my dark eyebrows and really pale face and everything because it's still like natural around here. I've been wanting to dye my hair since I was like 13, ever since I watched Scott Pilgrim vs. The World basically. Yeah, I don't really know what else to say. It's very, very blue. There you go, that's one thing I've always wanted to do that I've now done. Okay, well I guess I'll see you in the next video. Um, I have a Thailand video that I need to edit and upload, but for now, thanks for still being here.